This is the Nokia Pro Power Battery Kit. It's a lithium-ion based battery that is going to replace their traditional 12 volt deer feeder battery that a lot of kayak fishermen have used. So, weight savings from this to this are amazing. So, I like to keep everything light on the kayak, so that's why I decided to buy this. So, here's what comes in the kit a uh, nice little packaging. You've obviously got the battery pack. Uh, the battery is inside this. It just velcros inside here. And it's just a, I think a rubber coated battery. Cable runs out through the, uh, the side of the pack. But nice little packaging. Uh, you get the power cable. So this goes to whatever accessory you're going to hook it up to. And you get the nice connectors on it. Waterproof with O-rings. Uh, power charger. Plug that in the wall. Uh, meshes up with that connector. Even give you some marine grade uh, heat shrink tubing. That's awesome. And the butt connectors are included to uh, splice this guy in. So that's great. You usually don't get that. It's a lot of stuff. So let's get this thing installed. Alright, so first things first. Locate your uh, power wires to your fish finder or whatever device you're going to hook this up to. So I've got the Garmin 73 side view. Um, got the wiring hangers here. Red and black. I strip both ends and ready to connect to the butt connectors. Uh, the power wire from the Nokia battery. Strip both those ends. And then just make sure you put your hink streak tubing on the uh, cable so that you can slide it over your connections when done. So now we're going to take the uh, butt connectors. Uh, crimp the uh, black and red wires color together uh, and then we're going to heat these, seal them up, uh, put the heat shrink over, seal that up and that'll be done. We're ready to connect the battery after that. So we'll get that done. Hang on. Alright, so butt connectors are on, uh, crimped and heat treated so that they're all sealed. These are some uh, some nice connectors. Glad they included them in the kit. Last thing to do, take the uh, Heat shrink tubing, marine grade stuff, slide it over the connectors and seal it all up. So we'll get that done. Alright, so we got the heat shrink installed. That stuff works pretty good. We got the battery uh, hooked up and the battery pack. So let's turn on the fish finder, see if our work was right. And yep, we got power. I'm not going to run this thing, I'm going to turn it off. But we know that works, so I'm going to tuck all my wires down inside. My power pack's going to go with it, and i got a nice little spot. And it's just going to sit right there, and uh, if I get another battery, we'll see how this thing does with a side view uh, transducer, if it'll suck it dry in a day. But I'd like to get at least eight hours out of it, so we'll see. But uh, I'll be able to do quick battery changes right through the, uh, the little hatch here. So that's the Nakua. Pro Power Battery Kit Install.